Another very warm day for large parts of the British Isles, with temperatures soaring close to 30 degrees Celsius once again, but not quite getting there. 28 degrees was seen in a lot of northern locations today in Glasgow, Dumfries and Penrith, as well as Cardforth Preston here at Force 13 HQ and in Cardiff, amongst a few other locations down that spine. Low temperatures overnight was at Thixendale once again, falling to 5, as well as many other locations, including Bridge of Tilt, in the Highlands and Oknahara. Right now then, we actually have no heat warnings in effect anymore for tomorrow. Just a flood watch that's in effect for some areas of Scotland, particularly around Glasgow. There's uh, possibly one or two storms over there this evening, uh, so interesting to see what might happen there. But overnight tonight, we'll see some uh, precipitation continue to move through and some substantial precipitation actually for the eastern coast of Ireland and across the Irish Sea there. Uh, it's going to bring in milder nights though, low temperatures down to about 14 there in a few locations, 9 along the east coast of England and Scotland. And it'll bring in a little bit of a breeze, some stronger breezes there as well through the Irish Sea but on Saturday what we're going to see then is much more cloud and that will prevent a lot of that sunshine from getting through and elevating those temperatures so uh, Scotland is still going to be quite warm up to 24 degrees maximum there and the warmest location will probably be uh, in the very far north there around Altnahara um, and those kinds of areas 23 in Glasgow and look further south temperatures way down compared to what we saw previously under a blanket of cloud not full cloud but a lot of it and a lot of rainfall in that as well especially over Ireland and some of it making its way over the parts of England. The southeast will probably be the driest area with the highest temperatures still getting to around 26 degrees Celsius although it will be mostly cloudy and probably very muggy. But a few areas there that are suffering uh, further north and northeast they'll finally get a little bit of rainfall there. Looking at the winds, it'll be quite breezy across the Irish Sea, moving up towards uh, Scotland. Not too severe winds, but you'll certainly feel that as well. Moving into the evening hours of Saturday, and you'll see that rain slightly abates there, but around the coast of Ireland we'll see a lot of rainfall continuing, but the southeast actually might get a little bit overnight there Sunday morning, with low temperatures of 13 or 14 degrees, and that will expand quite a lot throughout the day on Sunday, so it's going to be a very wet one actually for eastern parts of England, who have been crying out for a lot of rainfall as it's been very dry over there um, not so long after the western areas got their fill last week with the storms uh, but looking at temperatures they're still getting up there again 23 24 across scotland a little bit of precipitation especially further west it will be clearer further north across ireland temperatures getting up to around 21 22 in belfast which might just get away with a good day there but across england and wales it is very much a washout with a few locations there in the eastern part of england um, only getting to 19 there under that uh, big area of heavy rainfall throughout the day and there could certainly be uh, the potential for flooding impacts there for, for a time as that rainfall moves through. Certainly uh, could be very heavy stuff, uh, but I doubt it was going to be thundery, but we'll revisit that at a later date just to make sure. Uh, it'll be quite uh, calm though, not too strong winds. Uh, we're not really concerned about winds there, only getting to about 15 miles per hour gusts, I would say. And throughout Sunday evening, that big area of rainfall will shoot up further north so northwestern England and then a lot of Scotland getting a lot of that rainfall as well a massive area and back to good old fashioned British weather there overnight into Monday uh, and temperatures will be back up again quite a bit up to around 26 27 degrees Celsius cloud won't be too far away but northern England into Scotland will get the best conditions there although there could be there's some stray rain showers which could even turn thundery in the afternoon uh, but that's still very much up in the air with rain clearing off to the North Island hit and miss there as well with highs of 22. That's our latest weather forecast. We'll have a lot more to come throughout this weekend.